So Cars 3 has just come out in the UK. Now my quick rundown of the first two films. Cars 1, yes. Cars 2, no. So all Cars 3 had to do was be better than Cars 2, and unsurprisingly, it was. Mainly because Pixar got rid of all the stupid, ridiculous spy stuff and went back to a more streamlined and simple story like the first Cars. And the story of Cars 3 is a very safe story. Lightning McQueen is now a veteran racer, and all these rookies are coming up, and they're pretty much making him look really, really bad, and he's now really doubting his future. Is he going to keep racing anymore? And then it's your typical comeback story where Lightning McQueen starts training really hard to try and beat the rookie races. It's pretty much your standard boxing movie only it's cars and racing it's Rocky Balboa with cars that's exactly what it is more or less it's a very safe story and it works in the film but it being the comeback story it is very predictable at least until the third act it's predictable the first two acts you have all the typical comeback story tropes where Lightning McQueen is training and then he starts doubting himself about halfway through he doesn't know if he can really do this or not and then he starts to dig down and find the Lightning McQueen he starts getting better at the training and then the third act comes and it takes a bit of a different direction than I expected it to and I ended up liking it. So I gotta give props to Pixar for that third act swerve. And Cars 3 does have its fair share of touching moments here and there. It's not a great film though, it still doesn't really have that Pixar magic to it, you know, where the emotion just floors you and leaves you crying and just thinking about it forever once it's finished. Yeah, you don't really get that with Cars 3. There are some touching moments, like I said, but it never really hit me where I live like 90% of the other Pixar films did. And the story was quite predictable, like I said, up until the third act. Overall, Cars 3, there's not really that much to say about it. Nothing about it really stands out, nothing about it's really amazingly special and that does make it one of Pixar's least best films but not its worst film though it's a lot better than Cars 2 granted that's not very hard to do but Cars 3 is still a perfectly watchable film I didn't hate watching it I didn't dislike watching it there were a couple of chuckle moments here and there I walked out of Cars 3 going yeah that actually wasn't that bad so I'm gonna give Cars 3 a 3 out of 5 so Cars 3 what did you think about it let me know in the comments below and if you want to see more of my stuff be sure to subscribe and I'll see you all in the next video